I feel like we just did this in June, <laughs> but welcome back to Leander High School. I'm glad to be back. This is all still the same. No, it's, nothing's changed. <laughs> so last year, I think when y'all came, we had yep. about 400 kids here. Oh, wow, now look, this is already a change. Nearly, Whoa. nearly all 2,000 back. So, hey, Mr. Kelly. Hello. I love it. I know, it's fun. Do you want to talk? No, are you sure? OK, because we can do it. So welcome back to a full bee lunch. Whoa. <laughs> So this part's been awesome, is having them back. Oh, you can feel it. Look at them. They're excited. Here we go. But you need my key. <laughs> hey! What do we say, guys? Hello! Hello! Oh, Christopher, is this... Is this your birthday right here? Yes, that's really my birthday. What are you gonna? What do you want for your birthday? Uh, I think I want waffles. Wa oh, I love waffles. Me too, bro. Go ahead. I love chocolate. It's so good. Oh, it's good. <laughs> Trust me. Jace is in our marching band. Well, you're a percussionist. Yes. Yeah. I used to play the drums too, Jace. High five. High five. Yes. So basically, an ICAP classroom, um, especially at the high school level. Um, we're, looking, we're working more on like functional skills, vocational skills, um, how um, we can get these kids as independent as possible. So what do you like about this classroom? It was fabulous. It's fabulous? So you're having a great year this year? Yeah. Are you glad to be back in person? Yes. Yes. You're doing some math, some um, counting? Yeah, I'm working math. Do you, do you like doing this, handling money? Yeah. Me too. Nice. Like in here, you saw us working with money. Um, we're working with um, jobs around campus. But then we also work with the kids on, um, at this point, we want them to know words as a whole. And so, especially your functional signs, safety signs, understand what those mean. Um, but like I said, just to be as independent as possible and, um, and have a good time doing it. Hello, how are you, Becca? How are we doing, we good? Yeah. Love the lion. So this is new. So yes. Mr. Robbins was integral in getting this furniture here to have that flexible learning Love space. It. You sometimes see yep. a Danielson and a Glenn. Mm -hmm. So we're working on building that space here. So teachers will send kids down to collaborate and work on stuff. So I know I we've like this. Made use of the atrium. I love it. I know. I remember seeing it three years ago. Hey Randy. Hey Lucas. Hey Miss Bloomridge. Hey Pooja. All right. Let's see. Let's get. Oh. And she said she was in a meeting, probably not telling us the truth because she knew y'all were going to be here. So here's one sixth of our counseling staff. She's my counsel kids counselor. <laughs> She's I the thought best. they were all going to be in the hallway, so they're working on their senior one on ones. So, how has this year been? Uh, Coming back in person, full campus? Busy. Very, busy. very busy. <laughs> and you know what? It's back to, I want to say back to normal, but I like seeing all the kids. I like these guys. We have fun. And we've been busy, that's to say the least, that's for sure. Um, but, you know, we're doing what's in the best interest of the kids, so I think we've got, where's my son? Oh, we've gotten uh, pretty positive feedback from kids and from parents, so I'm pretty uh, optimistic about that, so. Y'all thought y'all were going to escape. Oh, no. Hi. <laughs> hey. How's your year going? Fast and furious? Yes. Yes, we've been um, meeting with our seniors. Just reviewing like senior timeline from beginning of senior year all the way to May 26th of 2022, so graduation day. <laughs> that, that's what we got going I on these last, that's a lot of fun. fun. <laughs> Thank you, I'm sorry to interrupt, kind of. <laughs> so we are Air Force ROTC, okay. VISTA is Navy ROTC. VISTA Ridge and LHS are the only two high schools with, with ROTC. ROTC. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Oh, this Whoop. is already cool. So last year you were here virtual. Yes. How, what did ROTC look like virtual? I'm trying to imagine. I don't know how that works. It was difficult because we had half the students here and the other half were actually at home. So we had to kind of teach, um, you know, teach the kids uh, that were here. And then we had to go ahead and do the ones that were virtual. So for an eighth grader considering joining ROTC, what's some advice that you have for them? Be prepared for anything. It's uh, it's a fun program, but there are a lot of things you should uh, volunteer for, like joining staff as soon as you can, be an element leader, be a flight sergeant, do something. something. Like, this is my second year, and I'm already operations in CYC. I get to help plan the events we do. Wow, congratulations. As a sophomore, it's pretty, yeah. pretty amazing. I can't wait to watch you. You're going to do some amazing things. We will see. Oh, ho, ho. Hello. So Bryn is one of our student leaders in Bluebells, yes, and she gets to work with 
this marvelous group of students who will perform sometimes at halftime, and sometimes in spring shows. Spring show and in Christmas shows. So yeah. she teaches routines and stuff. So our students teaching our students and this is one fantastic kid, so. I did it last year. Um, I taught kids and it's super fun. It's a really good learning experience and really good leadership. And I just enjoy teaching kids and I just love their ability to dance and it's super fun. Thank you so yes. much for of doing course. everything. Of course. Good job, Bryn. Good job, buddy. Good job. Yeah. yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Wait, are we fist bumping or something so it's not all awkward? Just saying hi? I'm asking you. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. I was told to prepare nothing but the three areas, Miss Smith. <laughs> okay, fist bump. Just bumping. come on in. You want to do a dance? <laughs>